I was talking on my other video about using the, po the proper test kit to check acid in your oil. And with Daikin guys, you know, everything is PVE in those. But like Sporlin, if you notice, it doesn't say anything about PVE. But on their website, the test kit, for this test kit, it tells you it will test PVE. So it's kind of poor, poor packaging. They need to update it. Because what you get, you get your indicator solution. Then you have two bottles of neutralizer. If you look at the one bottle of neutralizer, POE, you do not want to use that for your Daikin oil in your VRV systems. They use PVE. But on this one, mineral, alkabenzene, and polyvinyl ether. So they have the capability of testing polyvinyl ether, PVE, in their test kit just doesn't tell you right here so anytime you are testing your oil make sure you use the right neutralizer now here's another thing to think about I am very anti dye things you put in a system to help find your leaks and if you somebody has put dye in a system leak detection additives may affect color change point of kit avoid using kit on these systems now I've had systems where when I when I put the, poured the oil out the oil almost glowed. I mean it was very 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 yellow and you can get yellow oil with acid. But you can also get when you get a kind of a neon yellow oil usually it's a dye kit. But when you're not sure and of course your customer says, "Oh, I don't use dye." Well, you throw one of these in there and it comes back positive for acid. Guess what? They're going to get the labor the time and material to have filter dryers put in in order to scat, you know, clean up the acid in the oil. So do not use dye in a Daikin system. They don't approve it. And you will find a leak if you're tenacious enough even though those systems are big, you will find a leak. It just takes time and the proper leak detecting equipment. But I wanted to share with you the packaging faux pas that they have done here by not putting PVE on the front of their package. If you didn't get on their uh, website, you would not know. And your salesman who carries this stuff, hopefully they know that this is good for PVE. I just wanted to let you know and share some information with you guys to use the proper oil test kit when you're dealing with PVE. Thanks for watching. Catch you next time.